Hey, what's going on? Uh, it's Sam, and today I'm going to go through an issue that I had with my Razer connected devices. So right now I have a Razer Diamondback, and let's see, a Razer Deathstalker Chroma. Uh, and technically these are considered legacy devices by Razer, uh, and so they're no longer supported by, let me pull it up, um, they're no longer supported by Razer Synops 3.0. So as you can see, I have a Firefly connected, um, and that shows up in 3.0. And if I go down to 2.0, the old one, uh, you can see down here I have the Deathstalker Chroma and the Diamondback. So when I open it, let me pull it over here, open it, shows my stuff down here. Now, some people, uh, including myself, I was having this issue today. So I went to update my drivers, and... Uh, my my uh, Diamondback was kind of acting up. It was being a little weird, like it wasn't really working that well when I would move my mouse. So I updated it, and I thought that'd fix it. Uh, and it fixed the mouse, but then my keyboard, uh, the Chroma was still working, but I was getting this error. Uh, and, I, and all of my keybinds were not working. So when I went into the Razer Synops thing, this is what was coming up, this error. And so I don't know... Uh, if it's something to do with the new drivers or what, but this is how I fixed it. You don't have to download anything. You don't have to do any installs. Um, if you've had these devices before and you've had them on previous hardware, this is all I had to do. Uh, and you, you, so you type in dev. Uh, if you're on Windows 10, uh, open up device manager. Go here. This is the really uh, kind of weird thing. So you have keyboards, mice, and other pointing devices. Uh, and so as you can see I have a Razer Firefly, Diamondback, Deathstalker, Chroma uh, and the thing that's weird is that is my keyboard uh, and it's in the mice and other point devices thing and then on keyboards my Diamondback which is my mouse is on keyboards doesn't really make sense I'm not quite sure but what I did was I went click on here go to update driver don't search just click browse my computer don't do this because it's literally impossible to find let me pick from a list of uh, drivers and on here, uh, what I did was I just clicked on that one, click Next, Installing Driver, and then Close. And it should work. So yeah, so my thing is still working. Uh, obviously, I fixed this beforehand, so I made this video because I knew it, knew it worked. Uh, and then for Diamondback, go to Update Driver, uh, Browse My Computer, same thing. This is ideally what you want to see. You, you'd like to, well, me personally, I'd like to see when the drivers are from. So at first when I did this, I said 2017, that's probably the newest, I'll go with that one. Didn't work. Go to 2016, and immediately, immediately when I went to 2016, um, it, op it, it showed up. Like within 10 to 15 seconds of me doing the update, it showed up. So click on the 2016 one, I've already done it, so I'm not going to, um, but do that and, and it'll pop up. Um, and then also, I just did it just for good measure, the same thing in here. So browse, let me choose, yeah, and so I think I think the reason it shows the dates on this one is because this is the actual, um, the Deathstalker Chroma, oh wait, actually, yeah, I don't know, I don't know why, I'm confusing myself. Um, ideally, if you can find it and it says 2016, that's the one you're looking for, that's the update. I don't know if the new updates broke it or removed the compatibility or whatnot, but do that update. You don't have to restart. Um, if everything works correctly, assuming you have those updates, it should pop up. All of your macros, um, your customizations and whatnot should be here. Um, and so you guys should be good. So hopefully this video helped you. Uh, I know I was pretty confused. I looked at a lot of videos, and a lot of them said to update and uninstall and do all this bullshit. This is what worked for me, uh, and I hope it works for you guys too. So thanks for watching.